guys, May here, and today I'm doing an unboxing of Pentagon's fifth mini album, Demo 02, and I am very, very excited about this because I feel like I just unboxed a Pentagon album, but I didn't. It was actually quite a bit ago. Anyways, I love the title track for this album. I actually haven't heard the rest of the album. Um, once I start collecting a group for a little bit, I don't feel that it's necessary to always listen to the album before buying it. Um, also, there was so much music last month that I just constantly felt like I wanted to listen to 8,000 different things all at the same time. And <laughs> so, yeah, I just ended up um, not listening to this before I got it, but it's okay. I will listen to it after I film this video. This is the front cover. It's very, very similar to their first album in the demo series so i'm wondering if this is gonna be a trilogy or what they're planning with this but either way i'm excited okay well let's go over track list first so there's six songs on here um i've heard violet i've heard runaway and those are the only songs i've heard so it looks like there's a vocal unit song and a rap unit song and then there's all right on here which i assume is another ot10 song you open it up. I'm gonna zoom out just a little bit. I'm actually pretty far zoomed in. So let me get my random stuff out. I'm not sure where it is, but then we'll go through the album. There's also probably a random number CD plate in here or a random group CD plate. I don't really know what the CD plate rules for this album were. So we'll discover that together. But I pulled the random stuff out of here. Oh, I forgot the ads. Oh, I got two ads. I wonder if everybody gets two ads or I'm just special. So we'll go through this photo book first, assuming I got everything out of here. And there's no CD back here. No, it must be on this side. So yeah, this one says Pentagon. We have some Juno. Oh my gosh, he's on like a train or a bus or something. Next we're gonna have Edon. Someday this blonde hair will not exist on Edon's head and I'll be real happy. <laughs> Hui, I really like the red hair on Hui. Him and Wano are both rocking the red hair right now. Though I wish Wano would stop dyeing his hair, but Hui can dye his hair. That looks like Yo one, my main man. I feel like every other album I get lucky with Yo One's random stuff. And last album I didn't get his card. I got uh Jino's card. So maybe I'll get him this time. That'd be cool. Though there's probably two photo cards. Well I pulled two things out of there. Here's Hong Suck. Can we just talk about how not to like bring another group into this unboxing but if Hong Suk had been an icon he would have only released two releases three releases how many do icon have I think it's like three and in Pentagon this is his fifth mini album that he's participated in so I was really sad when he didn't make it into icon but I think he's just doing really well in Pentagon and I think this group fits in much more so yeah we have Kino. I didn't even recognize him for a second. That is Shin Wan. That is an interesting photo of him. It's like, who are you? Oh my gosh, Yuto. Yuto looks so good. In my audio only, um, audio music video, video that I did, um, for November, I had the scene like him like walking, and I was like, I keep I kept watching that video back just to make sure everything was timed correctly and the volume was okay and everything, and I kept being like, oh my gosh, you two look so good in that scene, <laughs> so handsome, Yanan, he looks really good blonde. I keep forgetting he's blonde this era, and then I'll randomly see a picture of him and I'll be like, oh Yanan, oh is that Usak? Look how soft. Oh, he looks like Chris Wu, actually, in this. Look, literally Chris Wu left EXO to join Pentagon. This is him, right here. This is Chris Wu. 
check out his song Juice. That's like the only song I know by Chris Wu. <laughs> it's such a random song too. We have Violet. I really like this song. They did an Animoji version of the music video the other day. And I was just like, this is the definition of 2017 is K-pop groups releasing music videos with the songs with Animojis. Like what is life even? I don't understand. Here's the lyrics to Violet. Oh, they are on a train because they're standing on a train, duh. We have Yoan and Hui with Runaway. I love this song, probably one of my favorite Pentagon title tracks. I think it's made by Hui, right? Yeah, Flow, Bo, Flow Blow and Hui. And then Hui, Yidan, Yuto, and Wutsuk all wrote lyrics. <gasps> look how cute Kino and Hansuk look, my little boys, they're so cute. Love them. I need to listen to these other songs. Then we have Yuto and Shinwan. Visuals. Pretty boys. Agree. And then we have Chris Wu and Yana. <laughs> I apologize to any XOL out there who are like Chris Wu fans. Who are like, stop calling him Chris Wu. It's not his name. Alright, that's it for that photo book, which means it's time to see my random CD plate. I don't really collect Pentagon CD plates, but you know, it would always be nice to pull Yoan's CD plate. So, I'm just gonna throw that out there. Oh yeah, it's here. Oh, is it just Yanan? Oh, I got a Yanan solo. Oh, so these are like, solo. This is not gonna focus. Oh, I have my focus on and I need to turn it off, I guess. So it will focus up here. But yes, I got a whole Yanan CD plate. We'll have to see who's Afro 7 Love pulls. Because I don't know if she collects Pentagon CD plates. She might. So I will have to let her know that I got Yanan's CD plate. Oh gosh. I'm filming in a different place than I usually film. Because it was too sunny where I was filming. Usually. So... Not for like face videos, it's like perfect for face videos, but for table videos it was like too bright and I hate when my videos turn out like too bright. So, yeah. So, that's super cute. I always feel bad, I don't know if this is just me, but I always feel bad putting CD plates in my CD player to get the songs off of them. I'm just like, Yana, why am I putting you in my computer? Like, I don't, ugh. I mean, not that my computer has like a CD thing, I have an extension for it because Apple. That would be too hard to put like a CD player on the actual thing. Gino, oh he's so cute. Wusok is my second bias, but Gino has lately been like doing things to me and him and Hongsuk were my original potential biases when I was like just getting into Pentagon and watching Pentagon Maker and everything. So, yeah, Hong Suk looks real ugly in this outfit. I really don't like this outfit. Ooh, Yidan looks good here though. I hate his blonde hair so much. <laughs> Will may have anything positive to say in this video. Shinwon looks really good. He's a visual. Yo, Won. I love your sweater even though it looks like an animal ate it. But I love your oh gosh, she's so cute. Let's see, Hong Suk and Gino were supposed to be my biases, and then Yoan was like, nah. And then Yanan's next, looking super handsome. Yuto. Oh, Kino, he's so cute. He just reminds me of Hoya so much. Uh, and Wu Suk, he looks more like Wu Suk here, less like Chris Wu. Wouldn't that be funny if, like, randomly everybody found out they're related? That'd be hilarious, I think. Oh, he's so cute! I love these group shots. They look like they have so many more members. For big groups, I feel like if you don't know the members, they look, like, ginormous. Like, I can't even imagine watching a 17 performance without knowing who any of the members are because like oh my gosh 
I was watching a The Boys performance yesterday. Recently got into them, and um, I don't know if I'm buying their stuff yet, but I was watching their music video, and I was like, oh my gosh, there's so many people in this group. And then I was like, I have 12 members. Is it 12? And like, it's really not that much more than like any of the other groups that I stand. So I don't know why it was like, that's so many people, but it's probably because the only person I know in that group is Hakyun, Hakyun. But anyways, that, that's a pentagon. Um, so got some random stuff in here. There's like a big card and a normal size photo card. So we're going over the big card first. <gasps> I got Chris, w <laughs> I got Wusak. Oh, he's my second bias. And this is such a huge card. This is a really big photo card. Oh my gosh. But yeah, that's his signature on the back. Oh my gosh, he's adorable. Look at look at him. What are you doing? I don't know like that many people who collect Pentagon, so I always have a hard time finding people to trade with. But let me know if you would trade Usak for um Yoan. Otherwise I might go buy his big card and keep Usak Usak because second bias. And I, I don't know how often I pulled him in my last CD plate. And I don't know. How often I pulled him besides that. I don't think I've pulled him that much, but yeah. And then my photo card is Yohan with his cute sweater on the beach. Oh my gosh, you are the cutest boy ever. So yeah, it seems like every other album <laughs> I will pull something Yohan. So that's exciting. It sucks for those other times where I don't pull you one, but because like I said, I never can find anybody to trade with for Pentagon things. So yeah. Um, and like I said earlier, I got two advertisements. Not sure why, but that's cool. Um, so yeah, that is it for this unboxing. I love Pentagon. I I hate how much random stuff they have. I don't know how many like normal size photo cards there are. If there's just the big card and this little card, I might just like try to find either a trade for Yo One or buy Yo Ones for this. But for their card, their albums that have two like small cards, I think I'm just gonna do one photo card because they release music so fast, which is awesome. But when it comes to collecting, it's not awesome because like I'm busy collecting Monster X and Super Junior right now and I'm not really focusing on any other groups besides that. Um, unless like somebody comes to me and says, hey, I have a trade for this or I find somebody looking for what I have. Um, I'm not really going out of my way too much to do trades for other groups right now. And when they release albums like every two months, I just, and nobody trades me ever. <laughs> I just have to like kind of fix my rules for them but anyways i'm super happy to get you once did i show you the back of your ones card this is the back of it not sure why my exposure is doing this it says pentagon demo 2 fifth mini album and then it says you one's name at the bottom and yeah i think that's it for this unboxing thank you so so much for watching if you want to see what else i have coming go ahead and look in the description box down below and i will see you guys very very soon bye